Two Hours is about the greatest runners on earth and the quest to break the two hour marathon. It's a story about one man in particular, Geoffrey Mutai, for some time the fastest marathoner on earth and about what it means to be a truly world class runner. What does it take to be a great marathon runner? Well, it helps to be Kenyan. And in particular, it helps to come from a particular tribe of the Kenyans called the Kalenjin, who win almost all marathons. They have certain physical advantages. They grew up at altitude. Their lungs have a greater power to ingest oxygen. A lot of them walk and run to school as kids, so their feet are really strong. But then, once you've taken that group of people, five million people sitting at the edge of the Rift Valley in Kenya, once you take away all the equalizing factors, what makes someone great in Kenya? Joffrey Mutai is one of those people who has been brave several times in his career. Every time he goes out, he, he puts everything on the line. And he's failed a number of times at marathons, but he's also run some of the fastest marathons that have ever been run. He ran 20302 in Boston in 2011, which was then by some distance the fastest marathon ever run. He also broke the course record in New York by two and a half minutes, which nobody thought was possible. He's one of the all-time greats of the sport. He says he sacrifices himself. So he puts everything down, and if it works, it works. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. He's not gonna cry about it, and he'll come back and try again the next time around. To me, he's an astonishing runner, not just because of the gifts in his own body, but because of his mind and because of his soul. I, He's a, he's, a, he's got a big soul and he's able to comprehend that life is bigger than one race.